Hey family, I am up and about. Today is another day in the Lord. I am grateful, I am happy, I am thrilled, I am thankful. And I just voted, so I'm absolutely thrilled about that. Um, man, I'm kicking five rows but today, all by the grace of God. But please do not misunderstand. It is fighting me back. But, you know, they say it's something about... It's not the size of the dog. It's the, the fight in them or something like that. That's pretty much where I am. I'm fighting. And I am fighting. And I will continue to fight because... I believe in we beat fibra. Not we're beating it. Not we're conquering it. We beat it. We have to speak life into the end game. And it really does start with your spirit. Because as elated as I am, my back is on fire because I had to stand in a line. It was worth standing in the line, it was painful. I was nervous my leg was going to give out and I was going to fall on that really nice lady in front of me. But thanks be to God, I did not and it did not. So I have not been arrested for assault. And that's about that. So if nothing else today, I encourage you to try something, I don't know, that you've been afraid to try. I don't care if it's Something as simple as just getting straight up out of bed. Don't think about it. Just get up. Or maybe there's something that you love to do that you haven't been doing because your spirit has been so drained by whatever it is that is, whatever malady it is. If it's fibromyalgia, if they're migraines, if it's MS, if it's lupus, if it's cancer, if it's any of those things, you have to remind yourself it's not your life. It is an occurrence during your lifetime. You have to get your spirit in a place where no matter what is happening around you, you can have joy and peace in the midst of it. That's all that has changed for me and it is everything. I have people looking at me now saying, oh, wow, you're cured. Absolutely not. And we can't stand here long talking about her. I'll fall. Or I'm in pain. And right now I have a pretty nasty migraine. So thus the shades. And thus I'm about to get in the house so I can get in the dark. But the truth of the matter is, I'm still going to do what I have to do today. Because my spirit says I can ride on its wings. It's that simple. Who knew? Fiber can't have me anymore. Chronic fatigue syndrome can't have me anymore. When I get tired, I'll rest. Not because of it, but because I'm tired. Because I've done the things that I wanted to do. Am I going to get crazy? Am I suggesting that you get crazy? No. We know our bodies and we know these diseases. So we have to be smart. But our spirits can soar in the midst of it. We will beat this. That's why I speak life to we beat fibro. All of us. We beat invisible diseases. All of us. We're doing it. We are in the process of doing it. Don't let anything make you think you're not doing it. Don't let anything or anyone tell you you're not doing it. Get rid of unqualified voices. That's something I heard recently from, there's a book called Camouflage. And it's on Amazon. And there are 14 amazing, empowering women that are transparent 
about their life transformation from where they've been to where they are now. It is an absolute must read. It is a transformative book. Tammy Jernet Lewis is the uh, one that put the anthology together. And it is, again, called Camouflage. And it's about the masks that we wear. Because you know us in Fibro. Someone says, how are you? We say, we're fine. I'm fine. We're fine. It's a mask. We're miserable. We're in pain. We're depressed. We're downtrodden. We feel hopeless. Take the mask off. Take them off. Feel what you need to feel. Deal with it accordingly. But don't let it touch your spirit. Because it is the spirit that is going to provide for you the sustenance to get you going. Those wings that you can sit on as your spirit takes flight. And once your spirit starts to take flight, you're going to will your body to get in line with that. Is it an overnight process? No. We didn't get like this overnight. Is all of this going to disappear for me or for you? No, it's not. But how we manage it and how we manage it within our lives, that's what changes. That's the difference. That is the difference. I wish you all a high energy, super wonderful spirit, low pain day. I love every one of you. No strings attached. Be blessed. And sore.